Oh, no wonder I couldn't see my guitar. on here? I think so. Yeah, I had to go live again because I said I, would, I said I was going to be back tomorrow. So I'm here back at it again tomorrow. But it's really not tomorrow, it's today. Yeah. <laughs> So, let's see, what could I do today? Kind of winging it here. I got my Fender and Mustang. Fender Mustang, American Performer Series guitar in this beautiful rose gold-esque finish. It's called Penny. Very, very beautiful guitar. <laughs> got my Fanny's House of Music shirt, which is a music store in Nashville, Tennessee. They gave me the shirt when I walked in because they're very friendly. show you a C add nine chord. So usually when people play a two five one, they'll do something like this, you know, two, five, one. But I like to go two, five, one. Then I'll follow it up with a minor two five one, minor two. Imagine just like a C bar chord, like one of those regular schmegular everyday C bar chords, right? Okay, just play a regular C bar chord. So how do you play it? So imagine an E major shape and then move it up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight frets, and then bar with your index finger on the A fret. That's a C major, right? So to play the C add nine, you're gonna take your pinky and move it up two frets. And that's a C add nine. So I really like this chord because it sounds like the gates of heaven opening up. Why is it C add nine? Because it's root fifth ninth third fifth and root. So if it were to be C major nine, then there would be a major seven in it. So C add nine is one three five nine. C major nine is one three five seven nine. So that's the difference between C add nine and C major nine. talked about super low grain yesterday. Yeah. Um, 
But yeah, I teach online guitar lessons nowadays. So if you want a guitar lesson with me, email Melanie Fay guitar lessons at gmail.com and I'll teach you some guitar. Yeah. But first I'm gonna flip my hair because I can. <laughs> I'm gonna flip my <laughs> All right, well, that's what I did. Um, how come this comment says two years ago? What is your advice for someone that is new on Neo Soul Guitar? But how come it says two years ago next to your comment? Like, did you type this two years ago and I'm just now seeing it? Or is your username two years ago? But um, anyways, how? what's your advice for someone that is new on Neo Soul Guitar? Take guitar lessons with me. That's my advice. Email uh, MelanieFayGuitarLessons at gmail.com. <laughs> All right. Oh, she a hustler, hustler. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I need to be more serious on here. I feel like I'm being really goofy right now. Nah, I'm just going to keep it goofy. Can you explain the chords where you bar the bottom four strings and then hammer on the high E two frets up? Oh. <laughs> So this one is actually a C major 7, so I'm barring the top four strings on the 5th fret, D, G, B, and E, and then my pinky is playing the 7th fret, high E. And you're thinking, how is that a C major 7? How is that not just like an A minor 9? It's because that's the 5th of the C major 7, so the bass note is not the root note. So that's the 5th. Then the G string is the root. Then the B string is the third, and then the high E string is the seventh. So basically, um, it's a C major seven uh, inversion. Uh, what inversion is that? Is that the that's that's second inversion, right? Right? Is that what that is? Dang, maybe, maybe I should take some guitar lessons. Yeah. Somebody said book yourself on lesson <laughs> lesson in 23 minutes. So I'm going to email all of my students the Zoom link. Well, actually, actually, first, first, I'm going to put some chapstick on.
Okay, so now I'm going to email all of my students the Zoom link to the class. So I got to go because the class is in 22 minutes. But if you want to listen, email Melanie Faye guitar lessons at gmail.com. <laughs> Hold on, let me type it in the chat. Wait, somebody's FaceTiming me. Ah, who's FaceTiming me? I didn't pick up. I declined. Melanie Faye guitar lessons at gmail.com. Did everybody see that? Email that. All right. It looks like I kind of do both. Okay, I'm going for real this time because I got to email everybody the Zoom link. All right, I'm going for real. No, I'm serious. I'm leaving. All right, I'm out. Okay, I'm going for real this time. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Um, email that. Uh, Melanie Fake Guitar Lessons at gmail.com if you want a guitar lesson and uh, I'll uh, I'll teach you a guitar lesson oh wait somebody said what's the name of my blue guitar this this is a um, a Fender Classic 60 Strat that I got in 2015 one day that's gonna make me sound really old. Like if someone watches this like 30 years from now, they're gonna be like, dang, 2015, she's so old. But um, yeah, this is a, it's a classic 60s strap, but it's in a limited edition color. The color is called Cerulean. That's what this is. I think that's what you were talking about. Unless you were talking about this one. Um, oh, this one is um, a D'Angelico. This is a D'Angelico Excel DC. And I don't think they have this color anymore. I don't think so. But this is actually not blue. It's actually seafoam green. Okay, I'm gonna stop flexing and I'm going to go for real this time. Goodbye. I'm out.